Hi guys, it's Kiki, and no, I am not standing around my apartment holding a knife for just any reason. It is because today in the mail, I received two corduroys beanbag beds. Holler! So, you guys can, you know, Google these if you don't know what they are. Um, they were on Shark Tank, they were a product on Shark Tank. I bought them from QVC because they were less expensive than the company's actual website and they are gonna be kick-ass beanbag chairs that unfold into a bed for my sister when she comes to stay. So, let's check it out. Now, I'm a little bit nervous about using a knife, of course, because there's a bed in there, so I'm just gonna try to be very gentle. It does say, by the way, vacuum packed, allow 24 hours for expansion. So that's good to know that it's not gonna be like fully inflated um, when you first take it out of the box. Don't forget to cut away, friends. Cut away, not like I'm doing. Okay, here we go. Here she comes. Ooh, okay, so this is the cover. And mine is the charcoal colored chenille cover. And then this guy oh, is the bed that's vacuum packed. So, in an attempt, oh, I see. Um, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna get some scissors and It's like all um, globular. Globular? Ooh. Oh, heavens. Okay, so this is it. Let me give you guys a little zoom in action. Okay, here is our initial report. This is like a very soft cotton like that would cover a futon. And this I'm a little bit concerned about because it's foam that's supposed to be on the inside of it so hopefully that doesn't mean there's a hole or anything um, I'm just going to start pulling oh you know what I bet there were directions to tell me how to do this oh yeah the ones that said stop how to unpack video cool <laughs> okay Okay, it's a funny story. Um, this how to unpack video is four minutes and 39 seconds. You will not regret uh, if you have one of these beds. So now I feel fully properly informed and I'm going to show you the right way to do this. So one thing to note right off the bat, these little pieces of foam, no big deal. Just don't even worry. You know, have fun with your vacuum later. Um, okay, so the first thing we're going to do is actually take out the cover, lay it down open on the floor, and then just dump this right into it, zip it up, and then just like massage it. Break up any lumps. Sounds like baking. Cool. This is super soft. It's the chenille one, as I said, in charcoal. It's the full size. And we've got a double zipper here. They're the kind of zipper that um, bends, which I think is the mark of a good quality, sturdy zipper. And the inside is like a muslin or like a netting, you know, like a little bit of a stiffer material. It's got a nice wide mouth. And I'm just gonna lay it down on the floor. Change my angle. Okay, cool. So, here comes the inside. Voila! I am gonna save that bag for use if I ever need to put a plastic covering on it. And I'm gonna zipper this guy up. It's super easy to do it when it's still vacuum packed, you know, because you don't have to negotiate with it. So now that it's all zipped up, it's still like in this firmly packed cube. So um, according to the video, you just kind of like 
bounce it around. Uh, <laughs> it's actually, it's, it's kind of fun. Okay, hang on, let me stand up. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, like, if you have kids, this is a project that they are gonna love. Just let them go at it. Okay, yeah, so I can feel it, like, starting to break up and uh, get air back in there. And like I said, it's kind of fun. So, anyway, I will come back in about 24 hours so I can show it to you all fluffed up. Cool. So you guys... <laughs> You guys have seen me unbox my corduroy and I mentioned that it needs um, like 24 hours for the foam to fully expand. So it looks pretty awesome. I'm gonna show it to you. Check this out. It is so awesome. I ordered two of these and for the sake of comparison, I unboxed that one um, a few days ago and then I just unboxed that one. Um, today. So that's about the amount that the foam expanded for me. <laughs> so one thing I want to mention, well first of all it's cool because you can like sort of conform it to your to your body like this, you know, so you can almost like make yourself um, a little armrest. Hey, I've really got it made because I can put my feet, oh, my feet can have this one because my husband's not home. Did I mention it's super soft? Like the chenille fabric? very soft. A couple things I will mention. One is you can order additional foam. Like you can see I am not that far up off the ground. I called the company and they are shipping me some extra foam so I can put it in here and it'll just be a denser, um, you know, even fuller, thicker than this. And it is adjustable in that way. You can also take foam out if you need or want to. And you guys, I love them so much that I ordered matching flicks stools and the footstools how cute is this like so these unzip into a bed and the footstools unzip into pillows how perfect is that so I'm gonna have two beds and two footstools so it'll be like the perfect setup if I have friends come to visit and stay overnight I ordered them separately because I just wanted to make sure that like I liked these and I thought they were good quality um, which they are by the way I think they're really well made and one thing I should have mentioned is when I first opened the box, I was expecting there to be some off-gassing or like some chemical-y kind of smell. And I was really impressed because I did not notice any off-gassing when I unboxed it. Then when I laid my face on it, like this, it kind of does have a smell, but I don't know what it is. It's like, I guess it's the way foam smells. Like I was saying, um, I wanted to wait to make sure that I liked them and also how they looked in the room to make sure that I had room for footstools. But what I am really excited about about the footstools is the past few days as I've been like lounging around, I do notice that when I put my feet out, you know, this is a whole other bag I have here right now, so that's amazing. But when I put my feet out, you know, like I just want some support under my knees and under my feet so that they're not just like, I don't know. I just need some support. I need some support. Oh man. Whew, I will say this. If you can, get to. I mean, look at me. I am in heaven. Imagine that I had a projecting screen and was watching a movie right there right now. Like, how great is my life? <sighs> You guys, I got so distracted with how comfortable my corduroys were that I forgot to like make any sense of the end of this video. Okay, yes, I've had a costume change because it's a different day. Just to wrap it up, I will do another video when I get the extra foam and when I get those footstools. I'll keep y'all totally posted. Let me know if you have any questions and thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!